One of the, um, the most common procedures that we do is prostate biopsy, which has traditionally been done transrectal approach. Um, and the risk of that is, is um, really infection um, that requires antibiotics around the time of the procedure, but potentially even can, despite that, can cause a life-threatening infection. So increasingly, we're moving towards a transperineal prostate biopsy, which is um, essentially a zero risk of infection uh, related to the procedure because the, um, the needle basically goes through the skin instead of through the rectum, which is the traditional way that it goes. Um, and so we, um, I, I perform that procedure um, in clinic as well as in the operating room with basically similar um, pain control profiles, but um, probably better access to areas of the prostate that traditionally we couldn't get to. And, which would be the anterior prostate, as well as um, essentially a zero infection risk um, related to the procedure itself. So that's an option for men um, who may have had problems with prostate biopsy in the past um, that are related to the transrectal approach.